An earthquake with an estimated magnitude of 6.5 jolted Fukushima Prefecture, northeastern Japan, on Sunday morning. There is no chance of a tsunami. The Meteorological Agency says the quake occurred at around 3.54 a.m. The quake's focus is off Fukushima Prefecture and is 57 kilometers deep. The agency revised the depth of the focus and the estimated magnitude a couple of hours after the quake. Tremors with an intensity of 5 plus on the Japanese scale of 0 to 7 hit Naraha town and Kawauchi village in Fukushima. The Nuclear Industrial Safety Agency says there have been no reports of abnormalities at the Fukushima Daiichi and Daini nuclear power plants. The Nuclear Industrial Safety Agency says there have been no reports of abnormalities at the Fukushima Daiichi and Daini nuclear power plants. <laughs> Torrential rain in northern Japan has caused rivers to overflow and increase the danger of landslides. About 210,000 people have been issued an order or advisory to evacuate. Nearly 70,000 households in Niigata and Fukushima prefectures have been ordered or advised to evacuate as of 8 p.m. local time on Saturday. I just escaped by car because the water levels rose quickly. I have nothing to say. All my electric appliances and the family outdoor sank underwater. So far, two people have been found dead in Niigata and a total of four people are missing from the two prefectures. Since Wednesday, up to 680 millimeters of rain has been recorded in some parts of Fukushima. Sancho City has gotten more than 1,000 millimeters. This footage was taken by an NHK camera crew on a helicopter above the Tadami River in Fukushima Prefecture. As you can see, the bridge was washed away in the raging current and a segment of the railway track is drooping into the river. The Meteorological Agency is calling on people to be on the alert for floods, landslides, lightning and strong winds.